Hello everyone, it's Anna from Anna's Paper Creations and I have another guest design team project to share with you and it's uh, for Pion Design and that is a Swedish uh, company and I will put the link here below to the website where you can find the store finder and also a lot of inspiration and I will also post the link to Pinterest below the video so there you can also find a lot of uh, pictures of the papers and uh, uh, projects made with them. So I made uh, two uh, layouts and uh, these are made with um, beautiful for mother paper collection and uh, for this uh, uh, layout here I also used another collection for this uh, polka dots here and uh, that is uh, a fairy tale of spring collection from PM Design. And uh, what I did here, I uh, fussy cut this paper out uh, around here and uh, it had a lace border strip so I cut around and layered it on this uh, paper here. And um, all the edges is uh, distressed with the Tim Holtz distress tool. And around I used some cheese uh, clothes and I used some uh, flowers from uh, Wild Orchid Craft, some cardinations up here and some leaves and also a rose here and uh, some rose buds and uh, this I painted and distressed a bit with um, with um, white paint and for this flower I used my Copic markers and uh, uh, airbrush uh, to uh, spray it over so that was really fun to do and behind here I have some cheese clothes and um, maybe start uh, first in the center here. Um, here is some Marianne design dice that I combined it together. So uh, I will show you a bit on how I did that but I can show you inside here first. So this can be taken out and this is a picture of me when I was uh, three years old. So uh, this goes inside here and um, for this um, a window here I used two different dice. I'll show you. So both these are from the Marianne design and uh, this is a uh, window die and this is uh, Petra's uh, bridge die I think. So here I used uh, this and then I, I put this inside. I have a paper here to show you. So I cut out the window a bit so it looks like so and cut a strip off each side here or up and placed this inside like so so I think it's really fun to combine uh, dice and you can get a lot of different uh, looks with them so on the side here I used uh, this one and cut in two for the sides here I used uh, this die from a memory box and it's a staircase classic die so I put one on each side I just flipped the paper over so I got them both away and uh, this uh, swirl die here is a cherry Lynn die and I have a seam binding bow here in the middle and fussy cut out a, a little butterfly here and also some corners uh, here uh, from Marianne design die and uh, on the top here it says Anna three years and it's a spellbinders die and I maybe give you a close-up here so uh, it's a bit dimensional on the sides here so I like to cut out frames for layouts and um, on the top here I just put in uh, three small tags just for some decoration or I can journal a bit on them if I like to and, and for the hanging here I made a bow from seam binding and here I have a coordinations flower and some uh, leaves from Bra Wild Orca Crafts and uh, some uh, lace leaves from my stash and uh, hanging down here are some uh, flower bead trim and also uh, some cheese clothes so that's uh, the hanging so I hope it shows up here like so and also um, 
down here behind uh, these uh, flowers here I have some uh, wine uh, um, dye from a memory box and uh, it's hanging down some flowers here from seam binding so and uh, when I made this I thought uh, this doily I cut out from the paper line and I thought this would be a great frame for uh, for a photo so then I had to make you uh, one more layout so I will show you that now. So here is uh, the other one and I used uh, the same frame here and uh, then I backed it with the same uh, paper behind here and all this is also popped up with uh, pop dots and I also covered both of these with the Claudine Helmut Multimat to get them a bit more stiff so they will hold a bit. And here you can see I used uh, the doily for uh, for the picture as a frame and I popped it up on uh, pop dots. And um, here it says uh, happy and uh, sisters here. And this uh, border die is from Lala Crafts die. And uh, the letters here I punched out with a Martha Stewart letter uh, punch. And this happy here is uh, Sherry Lynn die and also this flourish die here and uh, here I made a cluster of uh, flowers and this uh, coordinations and uh, here are some uh, um, lace uh, leaves from my stash again and a seam binding bow and some rose uh, buds from wild orchid crafts and um, on the top here I have uh, put in uh, two tags so my thought for, for this, I will give them this as a present and they can write something sweet to each other or what they like uh, uh, from each other as uh, sisters on this and placed behind here. So uh, remember to always uh, be good friends. And uh, yeah, I think I showed the most here. A glue down with uh, my glue gun, some lace here. And this is from uh, Wild Orca Crafts. And uh, the hanging here is also a seam binding and a coordination flower here and some leaves. So it's just hanging down like so. And I also made a couple of uh, bow here on the top. And this I made with uh, the Sutter Bow It Easy. Uh, uh, it's a really great uh, tool. You can make really tiny um, bows. wasn't in frame. Here you can see it maybe. So, I'll give you a bit of a close up here. So, I had a really fun time creating with uh, this paper. It's so soft and uh, beautiful. So, it's a bit of a romantic look. So, I hope they will like this and have it maybe displayed in their room or in somewhere in the house so they can look at it and always be friends. So thank you so much for watching everyone and have fun creating. Bye bye.